2020 saw ESG investing gaining a lot of traction with companies and asset management funds focusing on the parameters set under ESG, that is environment, sustainability and governance. In fact, at present around 4% of the global AUM is now ESG focused, which compares with just 0.3% that is in 2010. And if we look at the total number of funds, ESG funds now contribute to 8.5% of the total funds that compares with 2% 10 years back. While companies like Infosys has already achieved the zero carbon emission promise, many business houses like Rulab Tata's, Mahindra, JSW Group, Vedanta, etc., they have committed to carbon neutrality and are taking steps towards it. Now, let's look at ESG scores of companies in different sectors. Infosys, in fact, that tops the IT sector with an average score of 82. In industrials, it is Adani Ports, Jubilant Life Sciences in pharmaceuticals, BPCL in energy sector, we have HUL in consumer sector, Stara Chemicals, HDFC Bank, LT are the big ESG leaders in their respective sectors. And overall, it's Infosys that tops the list with 70.1 as the overall score. General trends suggest that manufacturing companies on an average score far better than service companies and private sector companies perform better than public companies. A Jeffries report suggested that Indian stocks with good ESG scores have outperformed 40%, that is since 2011, and the misunderstood ESG category companies like ITC and NTPC have underperformed. And if we look now at the MSCI India ESG fund performance versus MSCI India performance, well, it has consistently been performing better in last one, three, five years and also till date as well as returns ranging somewhere between 8 to 14 odd percent. In fact, a number of mutual fund houses have launched ESG funds in 2020 with the most recent one being Kotak ESG fund in December. Around six funds have been launched in 2020 itself and Quantum ESG fund that was launched in 2019. The oldest one in the country is SBI Quantum Equity ESG fund and it looks like we can see a lot more of them in 2021 as well. Thank you.